How am I looking? I'm looking all right. <sighs> Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Aaron the Big Black Dude here with another video. And uh, today is a little different because yesterday uh, I put out my MGTOW video. If you guys want to check it out, I'm going to put it somewhere up here. Probably. Maybe not. But I'll put it up here. You know, if you guys could see it. Um, and maybe I might be wrong a little bit about the MGTOW movement. Now, I might have been a bit abrasive uh, yesterday. That's because I'm an abrasive fucking guy. Like, this is who I am. Uh, and uh, someone made a comment uh, very recently. Um, I, I'm looking at it right now. Uh, his name is Tigersy. Um, and his comment says, MGTOW is revolutionary, and it is truly just for men. It cannot be controlled, and that angers and frightens a lot of people. Some will eventually come to understand MGTOW, but some are so stuck on blue that they never will. But part of the beauty of MGTOW is that it doesn't matter if others understand it or not. It doesn't matter if others agree or disagree with it. It doesn't matter if it angers people. MGTOW, MGTOW cannot be controlled, and people are just going to have to deal with that. It's an interesting comment. It's an interesting comment that he uh, put on my uh, video, my last video, if you guys want to check it out. Uh, and it makes a lot of sense. You know, it makes a lot of sense. Uh, I'm doing a MGTOW thing in a way and going against the the as he as I call them pussies but I mean everyone everyone expresses themselves in their own way everyone expresses themselves in different ways um I want to I want to agree to I want to agree to a large degree that I understand that the movement because men have been fucked Let's just let's just keep it real. I mean, I don't know. I haven't talked to any man in the last me any any rational man in the past I don't know 5 years that hasn't told me that men are fucked. You know, and it's just getting apparent that it's just any sort of male behavior is just unfucking acceptable in today's today's society and it's crazy. We men, we do we do things. We we talk shit. We joke around. We make crude jokes. We make racist jokes. We make. I mean, their jokes are funny. So how can I? How can I uh, be? How can I stand above that and say that I know what the fuck some of these people's intentions are? If some people make money off of MGTOW, fine. That's men making money in service of men. I don't see that as a loss, you know. I don't know if any any of the uh, feminists would have something to say about that. But their movement is massive. They just, they're, you know, here's the thing. Women hate women. I don't know how. I don't know how this feminism movement is. Uh, is is still gaining traction women hate women except for when it's against men so they just fucking form like voltron whenever like god forbid you've been you had to be in a situation like this where you're talking to somebody who is called let's say another female a bitch and talk shit so much shit to you but the second you start talking to them about that other girl, they feel forced to defend them. I don't defend guys if they're pieces of shit. I don't defend guys if they do something wrong. Only women do that. So, but we have, we, I understand the movement has to be, uh, the movement has to be solid. I get it. I, I, I do get it. I still think it's a bitch move. I honestly do. That sounds like some bitch shit. Men just, just men, men just stand alone. My version of a man is, 
is is just different. I don't need to stand with people. I don't need to stand with anybody. I have, I'm a, I'm an army of fucking one. Always have been. Always will be. Gonna die that way. And I'm okay with that. I don't really. I don't like labels really. Uh, so maybe that's why the MGTOW thing sort of got under my skin a little bit. And I'm going to do some more research. I'm going to do some more MGTOW research because you motherfuckers might be onto something. But I still hear a lot of vaginas in that movement. And I might have to call some of you guys out eventually. Uh, but this is just a quick little rant. You guys have a good day. And I'm going to go... Spend time with my kids and live life. Uh, see you later, guys. Love you, Aubrey. Peace.